Needing positivity all around you Made me life struggles trying to hold you down When your goal is being great to push through dark clouds That try to tear you down Why they want to tear me down Sagittarius, Sagittarius Hey, Sagittarius, Sagittarius Oh, Sagittarius, Sagittarius Ow, Sagittarius, Sagittarius Ow, what's up, Sag? What's up, baby? Did you miss me? Hmm? Hmm? Because I missed your motherfucking ass Listen Hey, well, hey, this is your first time to my channel I'm Mocha Also, this is your first time to my channel Look out, okay? I cuss, alright? May cuss a little, may cuss a lot just depends on what the hell this lick, what the fuck this lick read, all right? What the hell this energy is, be like, all right? Sagittarius, honey, this will be your timeless reading, okay? Uh, we're going to call it for the month of April, but this will be a timeless reading for the sign of Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, as well as the Cross Watchers. I had to go ahead and get your videos out. Energetically, you guys were screaming at me. You know what I'm saying? And I love y'all, but I ain't like that. I have to come in and check on Sagittarius, see what the hell is going on with my baby, sonny. All right? Thank you so much for the likes, the shares, the subscribes, the comments, the love, the donations. You guys, the readings, the love, the support. Thank you so much from the most humblest face ever. Okay? Um, sorry, y'all. Puppy ass is walking through here. Y'all know he always knows I'm doing a damn Sagittarius reading, so we're going to let him get comfortable because <laughs> it's just what the fuck he do. He's fucking... Y'all know since the beginning of time, puppy ass be all in y'all motherfucking mix. It's like he has this little Sagittarius radar on the inside of his motherfucking... You know what I'm saying? So listen, <laughs> gang is in the building, all right? So you guys, um, also, if you're new to the family, hey, hey, we're a little dysfunctional, okay, bitch? We don't fight fuss, all right? We, we cuss, though, all right? We share, we grow, we love, we enlighten, we evolve, positive vibes only, positive type things, we uplift, all right? We family up in here, okay? You guys, if you need a personal reading, that information will be found in the description box below. Um, this message ain't finna resonate with every motherfucking Sagittarius. Take what does, leave the rest. If that motherfucking shoe don't fit, don't try to force that motherfucker on. Your ass is gonna fall, okay? Leave that for somebody who they resonate with, alright? You guys, um, I may be, when uh, reading this energy, I may be picking up on you or your cross watcher, okay? Take, take how the fuck it resonate. Don't be in them damn comments painting the damn narrative because you mad at what the fuck I said. If it's your ass and you don't want to take your lick, that's not my problem, okay? I'm just the messenger, so don't shoot me. Don't be shooting your motherfucking arrows over here, because my duck game is marvelous. You understand? I ain't got time for that. All right? So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into you guys' reading, um, your timeless reading, all right, that we doing in the motherfucking April, all right? So um, Sagittarius, you guys, whew, listen, I got so much of, of, of a flood uh, while digging into your energy and meditating on your energy. Um, you guys, and when I heard flood, so this could be a flood of emotions, flood of blessings, okay? But I definitely picked up on the energy of a flood, all right? Also, uh, a lot of he say, she say, all right? Y'all know, uh, I fuck with mulatto. I'm hearing mulatto that damn, I don't do the he say, she say. Speaking on me, bitch, be safe. Big cake likes my B-Day. Uh, running up a band like Relay. Yes, okay, so listen, Sag, rumor has it, okay, is the name of this reading. Rumor has it, the number synchronicity that I got for you all were two. I got 1010, and I also got 5555, okay? So major endings, okay, major transitions, major transformations. I am hearing emotionally, physically, spiritually, okay? Some of you guys could also be choosing to uh, either cut something out of your diet. I'm also hearing fasting or there's a need to, all right? Sag, I'm also picking up on the energy as well of, I heard emotional blackmail, okay? So someone could be blackmailing someone emotionally. I'm also hearing gaslighting, emotional gaslighting, okay? So for some of you all, you're dealing with the fucking, you know, narcissist okay i am picking up on someone needing or someone being dependent upon you bending your will to this individual okay big uh big big strong emphasis on water signs cancer pisces scorpio i'm also picking up on gemini libra aquarius i'm also hearing you're watching okay while you're looking at the aries the leo the libra the taurus you need to look out for the Scorpio, the Capricorn. Gemini and the Cancer. 
okay so listen that resonate with who's it who it resonates with okay um a lot of activity when it comes to the crown chakra i am picking up on a lot of light codes a lot of esoteric downloads i'm also hearing con uh, conscious uh, cosmic consciousness okay cosmic awareness okay i'm also picking up on a lot of focus and a lot of studies or a lot of curiosities around divination okay i'm also hearing um I'm hearing spiritual practices. I'm also hearing religion versus spirituality. Also, when it comes to battles or an, an internal conflict within the self around your belief system, what's authentic to you. And I feel like some of you guys are going through this because other people who may be uh, who may be very religious may this may be a time where motherfuckers is really just talking out the side of their motherfucking neck, a bunch of weird ass fucking vibes and fake ass love. Y'all know I love y'all babies, but for some of you all, you're going to be able. Spirit is wanting you to. Feel through these situations. Surrender, but feel through these situations and trust what you feel so you know how to move accordingly, okay? For some of you all, I'm literally hearing the art of war, all right? So for some of you all, I'm also hearing petty competitions, okay? Uh, passive. So some of y'all can have water in your chart because I definitely, if you're not following me on Instagram, I don't know what the fuck you're doing. At mocha underscore, underscore, love underscore, tarot is weekly tea over there, bitch. What, you, what, are, you, what, are, you, what are you doing? Okay, um, but I did mention this in the water sign video over there, like passive aggressive ass, uh, like a passive aggressive ass energy or like silent ass competitions. Okay, big uh, big focus on on friendships, partnerships, collaborations. Okay, for some of you all, I am hearing stepping stones. Okay, stepping stools, stepping stones. So for some of you all, this could come in the form of someone who there needs to be a sense of closure with. I'm also hearing opportunists. I'm also picking up on the reconciliation from hell, especially if this involves children. If you're reconciling with someone solely to be with your fucking children because someone is emotionally manipulative as hell, I am picking up on this being very detrimental to your money in the long run. I am hearing the summer, okay? Someone is trying to... Uh, financially keep your motherfucking ass stuck. Misery loves company, Sagittarius. We not attending them type of motherfucking parties. To make the no more parties. Uh, 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 you understand? We're not doing that. Uh, 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 uh. Don't invite me to the motherfucking parties. The misery throwing, because bitch ain't got time. Alright? Won't be on the motherfucking RSVP list, okay? So this was some of the channel messages that I actually wrote down for some of you all, okay? Well, for you all for uh, this timeless reading that we doing in April, bitch. Okay, you guys, I got quantum physics. A lot of focus on the metaphysical, okay? And I'm also hearing, um, okay, so I'm hearing higher magic, higher realms. I'm also hearing access to the Akashic. I'm also picking up on LSD or, okay, so some of you guys could be wanting to take a motherfucking trip, honey, okay? Make sure you're around somebody who know what the fuck they doing because I am picking up on the fact that whoever this is and I'm picking up on want to take a trip, honey, Okay? Ain't no fucking talking you out of it. So I definitely pick up on you doing your research first and knowing what it is that you were um, really indulging in, my baby. Because I pick up on something about, I heard following the crowd. So this could even be something that you're curious about because someone close to you have been speaking about it. Okay, some of y'all, I'm hearing, I'm hearing, okay, this motherfucker is capping. No cap, all right. Uh, whoever told you that they went on a trip. I heard omitted truth. So this individual is not telling you every motherfucking thing. It's like somebody's somebody's trying to like gas you up on some guinea pig type shit. So beware of that. All right. I'm also hearing within your investments as well. Okay. Ask the right questions, Edge. Okay. So I got you guys got quantum physics. You guys got alchemy, high level magic. Mortgage loans for those of you who may be moving to a new home. I'm also hearing moving states that looks very positive. Okay, feels amazing. Okay, I am hearing new starts. I'm also hearing restructuring, re remodeling, restructuring, remodeling, rebuilding solid foundations. Okay, so some of y'all, this could definitely have to do with you. Okay, I'm also hearing something regarding the home. Like some of y'all really need to move things around within your home. I'm hearing spring cleaning. There's some Sagittarius out there that need to clean a motherfucking car. It's ridiculous, okay? Especially, you could, you could, and, and I'm also hearing whoever do, whoever needs to clean this motherfucking car, you also need to set boundaries on how people are riding in your car and what the fuck they doing. Some of y'all really got a lesson around self-expression and expressing yourself because people got you fucked up, all right? Just tag me in because I can get them right the fuck together, all right? 
<laughs> you guys got identity theft. Um, I'm, I'm also hearing with that identity theft tax fraud, okay? So for some of you all, some of y'all need to check into your children's social security, especially if you're undergoing some type of child support case or there was some type of, uh, like, custody battle when it comes. I'm also hearing a mother-in-law. So this could be involving someone who, oh, honey, family feuds. Identity theft, okay? Somebody did some fraudulent shit, Sage, all right? I also heard the signs that I named, who you need to look out for, okay? Lock your doors. Change the locks. If some of y'all just recently put a motherfucker out your house, I feel like somebody has a spare key or has access to a spare key or a spare of something that you are unaware of. I'm also picking up on somebody like being petty as fuck, especially if you just recently got a new car. Really, really, really watch your shit because somebody is petty as hell because they feel as if they lost. And this individual is so motherfucking low that they would go as low as vandalizing your shit, all right? Watch your shit and don't be a scared. Don't be calling the motherfucking police. It's not motherfucking, it's not weak. Your ass better be smart. You better get some motherfucking black and white that covers your ass just in case you got to show your ass, okay? Bitch, I told you, keep that motherfucker from around here. Y'all didn't know I was going to come out here with my back next time. I was scared, all right? Some of y'all need to learn how to be scared because people got y'all fucked up. Black and white, cover your ass, all right? You guys, uh, you guys got copycats, all right? So I am hearing, okay, so that's the silent competition. Sash, for some of you all, I'm hearing this is you, all right? Um, some of y'all, yeah, some of y'all, this is you. I heard you're so focused on what another person is doing or I'm hearing, okay, so some of y'all could have um, escaped some type of like narcissistic abuse or a situation that was very emotionally and spiritually, mentally abusive, okay? I feel like for some of you all, someone had the expectation that you weren't supposed to be shit and someone now is just stuck up on your motherfucking glow up, but it's really making them intimidated when it comes to really judging where they are in their own motherfucking life. I heard petty hustler, somebody's a petty hustler, all right? You guys got diaries of a sociopath, sensuality, vulnerability, expression, celibacy, tantric sex, observations, catastrophic discoveries, spiritual teacher, throat chakra, okay? A lot of emphasis around ending speaking up being authentic to what really matters to you i am hearing wasted time some of you guys you're holding on to a situation because you don't want to feel defeated even though everything around you there are so many signs and synchronicities to let you know that it's time to let something go i am hearing inevitable endings okay I'm also picking up on nutritionist, dietitian. Okay, so some of you guys could be nutritionists. Some of you guys could also practice some type of like holistic health or you're wanting to teach about this. Okay, a lot of symbolism. I'm also hearing ancient magic. I'm also hearing the book of Psalms being significant. Some of you guys are. Okay, so I'm hearing. Okay, so as y'all know, the whole fucking book of Psalms is fucking spells. Okay, but I am picking up on someone like explaining this also explaining the origin of something or i'm also hearing um i heard galactic race so this could be the origin of galactic race i'm also hearing dna uh, genetics dna codes genealogy i'm hearing alignment things falling at your feet for some of you all i'm hearing what he said she said and the truth Somebody has your fucking back, Sag, all right? I'm also hearing um, prideful. If you need something, I'm hearing help is here, but for some of you all, you're getting a lesson around receptivity at this time, all right? So let's pull from, oh no. We're going to pull uh, pull you guys a crystal wisdom healing oracle. What? The water? Oh, honey, thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I don't even know where the damn top at. That's all right. <clears throat> we gonna work. All right, y'all. My birthday is in two days, honey, and I had to get these damn readings out because the bitch will be unavailable between the twelfth and the fourteenth. Okay, as well as the sixteenth and the eighteenth. We gonna turn the fuck up. It's Aries season. All right, new starts. 
a lot of you all, I'm also picking up on uh, something being triggered, you guys being triggered when it comes to your childhood. I'm hearing childhood wounds, especially around expression. I'm also picking up on someone being, someone using children as a form of uh, manipulation. This could even be your own parent. I feel like someone's becoming the person who they dreaded the motherfucking most. Or someone's also realizing that they attract people who are elements of this individual's shadow self. Some of y'all, yeah. Some of you all, you Okay, yeah, some of you guys, this could even be some type of, like, custody battle between, like, you and your parent. Someone feels, or someone's trying to, like, judge your parenting skills. I feel like someone's trying to project a form of inadequacy on you. And it's because this person lacks the ability to take accountability for the fact that they didn't teach you that shit. I heard learned behavior. But your moves, your progression, your will, your ambition makes someone feel little. In order to get themselves out of that place, they have to try to beat you down or make you their emotional punching bag. I'm also hearing sleeping with the enemy, okay? Some of y'all, somebody trying to slowly move in your motherfucking house. You're like, no, bitch, it was just a hookup. <laughs> so, Spirit, what, what crystal would be useful for Sag? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Cross Watchers, North Node, okay? I ain't still seen this. It's pretty. You guys got pink granite. That's a beautiful stone. Some of you all may be seeing 333, 33, 66, 99, 999. Completions, things coming together, completions in order for things to come together to allow you that window of expansion, okay? I am hearing business, and I'm also hearing new starts, progression, entrepreneurship. Some of you guys are choosing to jump off the, yeah, jump off the damn cliff and take a damn chance on yourself, and it's going to be very profitable, all right? 36, y'all know we on chop and screw these motherfucking messages here, all right? 36, the lightning bolt, pink granite. Pink granite has the highest paramagnetic resonance of all stones and creates immense energy. You are an ancient Egyptian with the arcane knowledge that Rose entails, but you, are, but you originated in the stars. You understand cycles of birth, death, and rebirth, and immortality. You may have been involved in an ancient power struggle. Cut yourself loose. Become more grounded. Learning experiences occur regularly and serendipitous synchronicities put you in exactly the right place at the right time. Be assertive and make things happen. Events move with surprising speed once you focus focus your intention. See the whole picture of wait, see the whole picture before deciding. Be pragmatic. Don't give your power away. Maintain balance in a relationship. You need di diplomacy and tact. Lightning can strike twice. If dealing with ancient strife, look at the bigger picture. Everything must pass away. Death precedes transformation and rebirth. The frequency of this stone is earthy and high, good for all chakras. The timing is for things that happen out of the blue and those with the soul path of a lightning conductor for positive change, okay? Transmutation, alchemizing, all right? So I did pick up on the energy. I did literally hear co parent. I also heard past life relationships, soul contracts. Um, this could even be around avoidance, abandonment, okay? So some of you guys may definitely be triggered at this time. Your abandonment issues may be triggered. I'm also hearing childhood trauma around sexual abuse, physical abuse. I'm also hearing domestic abuse. I'm hearing quiet, okay, silent, silent strategies. Some of you guys could be strategizing to leave a situation. I am hearing moving states. I'm also hearing witness protection. Somebody could even be going to jail for like hurting a child. I'm hearing silent, secret addictions, double life. Someone could also be like. Some of y'all could be finding out that you're dealing with a masculine energy that has an addiction to like man on man or girl on girl porn, like homosexuality. I'm hearing homosexuality coming out of the closet, coming out of the closet both ways. This could even be someone in a marriage or a long term relationship. Shit. All right. So let's see. Let's pull from the intuitive deck to see what my sages, what messages is it that my sages are needing at this time. Show me the messages on my Sagittarius. Yeah, it's time. Sagittarius. Show me what it is. The Sagittarius. It's time. 
I'm hearing multi-dimensional being. I'm also hearing parallel universe. I'm hearing grounding, grounding your ability to astral project. And I'm also hearing, I'm hearing necromancy. Some of you guys are channeling messages from the dead or the other side. Some of you guys also may have some type of experience where you're connecting with an ancestor that is passed over in your subconscious space. This individual is trying to give you direction, okay? So what the fuck I tell y'all, diaries of a sociopath. Some of you guys disconnecting from someone who have sociopathic ass tendencies, okay? Or some type of sociopathic behavior. I feel like for some of you all, you dealt with this situation as well as persevered through it. Or you're persevering through it because ultimately you're supposed to share your testimony. It's supposed It was supposed to inspire you to spark your life purpose around advocacy is what I'm hearing. Also self-expression. Some of you guys are speaking. You're meant to be in the public eye. You're meant to be advocates for domestic abuse. Also, um, I'm also hearing incest. So, so I'm, I'm also hearing something regarding um, mental illness. So some of you guys could definitely be studying psychological behaviors or you're dealing with this or you're learning, through, learning this through experience, okay? Sociopath. Some of y'all, I'm also hearing mother figure. Some of y'all are dealing with a mother figure who could be interfering or someone tr obsessed over trying to fucking slow you down, delay you. I'm hearing that shit won't prosper, okay? You guys got karmic justice, okay? So some of you guys, I'm hearing front row seat. Something is coming to a something is coming to a head. I am hearing divine timing, perfect timing in order to free you from a situation, in order for you to go recreate your neck or, or, or like, I'm hearing recreate recreate your flow some of you all are also transmuting your sexual energy into energy okay into energy of creation all right so this could have, definitely have to do with some type of artistry i'm also hearing tantrics i'm also hearing healing sexual healing karmic justice some of you guys could definitely be dealing with the libra some of you guys could also be dealing with an air sign uh gemini libra aquarius with this yeah, you guys got fun and empaths. Some of you guys also have a connection to animals. Or you have some type of, I heard, telepathic connection. Telepathic connection to animals. You have the ability to communicate with animals. Or you have a life purpose around animals. Some of you guys are really wanting to discover or discovering or learning about your gifts or expanding them. All right. You guys got Samuel L. Jackson. So be very careful when it comes to signing documents. Make sure that you read over everything in which you sign it. And be careful when it comes. I'm hearing fast money. So somebody just, um, I don't know why I'm hearing loans. If someone is trying to use your name or use your bank account or use some something, uh, something surrounding institutions as well as like finances, all right? Successful leaps of faith. Then I tell you, whatever it is that you're wanting to start brand new, whatever it is that you're wanting to create, Spirit is saying now is the time. This is a great time to do it. I am hearing a lot of ambition, a lot of energy when it comes to creativity, creation, sharing your gifts, okay? I'm also hearing teaching other people how to ground their gifts, teaching other people the arts of magic as well, the art of, okay, the art of divination. You guys got sacral chakra, okay? Some of you guys are needing to ground your sacral chakra. I'm also picking up on a lot of lethargic energy, okay? For some of y'all, this could definitely be due to some type of karma surrounding spell work. I heard backfiring, Sag. For some of you all, this is you. For others of you, this could be involving an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Someone's attempts to bind you is fucking failing because your soul is immune to magic. Some of you guys were sorcerers in your previous life. I'm also hearing Atlantis, okay? I'm also hearing Egyptian. I'm hearing Comedics, okay? Holistic healers. Some of you guys could be holistic healers. Some of you guys could be cutting processed foods, meats, sweets, starches out of your motherfucking diet in order to, I'm hearing, sustain as well as expand your metabolism. All right, holistic healer. I'm hearing turning to the earth. Agriculture. Some of you guys may also be wanting to plant or start planting or, 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 or okay, I'm hearing crops, okay? So some of you guys is also having to do with the harvesting of your crops. The seeds that you have planted, you've seen some type of influx in what it is that you have uh, launched is what I'm saying. Okay, you guys got beautiful blessing, okay? Beautiful blessing. For some of you all, this is coming in the form of something material. I'm hearing the big payback, all right? But for some of y'all, this can be good or bad, all right? The big payback. You guys, they got, they want to be you, all right? 
they want to be you. So some of you all for that copycat ass energy. Some of you all someone that I'm hearing admiration turn envy, okay? Mutable sign. This person could definitely be a Sag, Pisces, Virgo, or a Gemini, all right? This could also be someone who envies your success, envies your ability to transmute situations and continue to persevere and keep moving. Someone envies your ability to, um, yeah, persevere. I heard, okay, so you guys got court case. I'm also hearing custody wars. Custody battle. Somebody gonna find out that a child is not theirs as well. Somebody's gonna find out that a child. Yeah, okay, so how I'm seeing this: someone could have denied a child. Someone's gonna find out that a child that they've been taking care of is not their child, but a child that they've denied is. And I feel like it's going to take someone in like this spiraling. I'm hearing, okay, I'm hearing addiction. So it's gonna make someone spiral out in addictions. Someone's feeling a sense of remorse, guilt for past decisions and I am picking up on this being something significant to a past life. I'm hearing ego wars. All right. So some of y'all could be dealing with a fire sign. Okay, you guys got males or intimidated by your shine. If you're a Sagittarius female, so who have I'm hearing who has your own business, somebody's envious of the fact that you're able to like grow. Somebody's envious of the fact that your business is successful. I'm also hearing envious of your psychic abilities. Bitch, jealous spouse. All right. Some of y'all are sleeping with the motherfucking enemy, all right? This could definitely be an air sign. Gemini Libra Aquarius, someone is trying to keep you stuck because they have no fucking purpose or no plan as far as moving forward or even creating that sense of um, spiritual, emotionally, physical health, wealth, abundance, happiness. Someone is depending on you to provide them they're happy someone's not happy they're not happy in a relationship but they don't know how to be by themselves okay this person is emotionally abusive all right but for some of you all there's a need for you to really tap into your gifts some of you all are psychic mediums all right i'm hearing okay so with this psychic we got premonitions vision strong intuition you haven't you're in this okay so i heard heightened intuition your intuition is extremely heightened at this time sag i'm also hearing some of you guys have the ability to see auras i'm also hearing feel lies you're clairsentient someone someone is inspired they admire your strength all right so let's pull on this shit in fact real quick we're gonna lay three tarot cards What's your advice for Sag? What's your advice? What's your... Damn, I said three. All of them failed. Yeah, continue. Focus on your craft. Focus on your money. I feel like for some of you all, if you're, if you're exiting the situation, if you're like getting out of something, if something is fucking ending, it's divine. It's literally, it's divine protection. I am hearing rejection is protection. Some of you all, Spirit, really want you to continue working on what it is that you've been... Um, that you've been working on launching or that you've been planning on presenting all right or sharing i'm also hearing working on your gifts attuning your gifts all right yeah you're going to be successful whatever it is that you've been working on you're definitely going to be successful queen of wands with your fine ass okay i am hearing divine messenger some of you guys are intuitives some of you guys could definitely be tarot readers some of y'all got a fucking jealous ass ex or a jealous ass motherfucking spouse who's watching you grow and this individual is afraid that you're going to leave them is what i'm hearing all right some of you guys could be moving forward from a situation involving a fire sign i am hearing final chapter i'm hearing closure so there could be a reconciliation occurring for you to uh, get some type of closure or for somebody to give give you some type of closure i am hearing forgiveness and again i'm hearing soul contract okay some of you guys again i'm hearing it's a domino effect some y'all you could yeah yeah some of you guys also could be getting some type of promotion at work. I'm also hearing um, transition, uh, uh, transitions within your career. So some of you guys could be um, completely leaving a damn job and choosing to focus on your business. All right. Good shit. You're going to be successful there, my babies. All right. But some of you all, you're stressed out about having to do so. Some of y'all, your move, your progress forward is really stressing the fuck out. Stressing the fuck out of an air sign. There's also an air sign that's afraid of some type of communication coming out regarding some type of addiction. I'm also hearing sexual addiction. Okay. This is okay. So I'm also hearing double sided out of the closet. All right. Some of you guys are going to find out something that is very detrimental. Oh my goodness. For Sagittarius women, check on your children. Especially if you're questioning this about an individual and you have a teenage daughter. Alright, Bishop Fear, give me balance. Balance. I bring a state of perfect harmony into my world and I do so without judgment. Alright? 
So whatever is falling away is ultimately to set your life up for balance, for things to balance out. Things are balancing out with your finances, okay? Things are balancing out when it comes to, I am also hearing um, missing funds. So for those of you who could have lost some type of money in an investment, you're going to get your fucking money back, Sag. Things are going to balance out for you. I feel like some of you guys had to lose something in order to make a damn decision when it comes to how you're going to move forward and making the best authentic decision or making the best decision that is authentically true true to you and your belief system okay you got and, and releasing the damn guilt about it you guys got guilt i release any beliefs that no longer assist in my soul's growth some of y'all i literally heard family some of y'all could be moving states to completely move away from your family some of you all this could even be people trying to emotionally guilt you making decisions for your damn self all right spirit is saying surrender to the process sage all right you guys got i can release my need to control if a relationship is falling away, it's because it's meant to, baby. Allow things to allow the chips to fall where they may. I'm also hearing somebody's being exposed for being the person who's fucking stirring the pot. Like somebody was trying to make it seem as if you the problem, or people around you were saying this person was the problem. And Sagittarius is moving the fuck on to this big ass cup and allowing the motherfucking towers down here to fall because somebody's not reciprocating that same motherfucking energy as if they want to build a relationship with you. Okay, so let's see who the fuck this could be or who this uh, reading could be resonant for. All right. My Sag. You guys got Scorpio. Alright. Taurus. Alright. Yeah, some of y'all have... Somebody's spell work is backfiring. This person don't understand how the fuck you continue to be great. You guys got Leo rising. You guys got Aquarius Moon. I heard there could also be spell work being done on a fire sign. Like someone's threatened by someone's position. They want someone's position, but you cannot stop. I'm hearing this This is a part of someone's North Node. Can't stop Destiny. Libra. Alright, give me two more for Sag. Okay. Two more. Leo Moon. Pisces moon at the bottom of the deck. We got Aries rising. All right. I'm also picking up on the energy of some a secret coming out regarding someone. Some of y'all could have been in a third party situation. Things got a little bit, you know, heat more heated than what the hell y'all expected. This could be involving a water sign. This person is having to make a very tough decision because I am picking up on exposure. So somebody could have actually some y'all could be find out that somebody either slipped with your family member. Or you slip with somebody's family member and there's a baby on the way from this. Somebody got a a very quick decision to make. Alright. I am hearing somebody got some planning to do. And this could be um I'm hearing the talk of the town, alright? So you guys message is gonna be named Rumor Has It. Alright. So I love y'all, my babies. I send you guys so much peace, love, and prosperity. I pray that this resonates, you guys, and I will see you all um within the next month or so. I love y'all.